What is up guys? Welcome back to another Crypto Camel video. Hope you guys are doing fabulous on this Wednesday afternoon. We got some exciting updates to go over for Hoge Finance. If you guys are enjoying these quick videos, remember to smash up the like button and let's just jump right into the video guys. So we're seeing a nice pump all throughout crypto market. Hoge saw a little pump, but also a big sell-off by a whale. And it's always good to see some whale sell-offs, especially when the price is in a dip, rather than having those big sell-offs at an all-time high. And guys, make sure if you're on Hoge.Report, drop a good vote for Papa Hoge on CoinMarketCap and CoinGecko. Small task that we can do that helps the project out. Like I always say guys, welcome to the Hoge party. Welcome to the Hoge Club. Hoge. Hoge. Hoge on Bitcoin.com. Bitcoin News. Hoge announces collaboration with the DeFi Angels. Now, Hoge is doing a bunch of stuff, but this in particular, kind of just abstract. They're helping out with crypto rights. Crypto rights not only benefits Hoge, but many other projects also. We have people involved with Hoge that are working and fighting for crypto rights and for DeFi on Capitol Hill with regulations and whatnot. And so this is great to see this a sponsored article on Bitcoin.com. When you guys go to the website, you can see it on the left. Check out the article. Hoge announces the collaboration. You see it right there. So it's really nice to see us on mainstream articles. And we're going to see more of this hopefully in the future. I'm really excited for the USA Today uh, article that's going to be coming up in three to four weeks. Moving on guys to pancake swap. So Hoj saying a great how to video for buying Hoj on BSC. This includes purchasing BNB, creating a MetaMask wallet, transferring BNB and making the Hoj purchase. A great video for any new crypto investor. Be sure to follow Hoj University for more content. Make sure you guys check out the video, drop a like, drop a comment. Make sure you guys are subscribed to Hoj University on YouTube because this video wraps up the entirety of it adding the MetaMask wallet extension, setting that up, adding the custom Binance Smart Chain network to MetaMask, making a purchase of BNB, and sending that Binance Smart Chain slash BEP20 token to your MetaMask, finalizing it with making the purchase on PancakeSwap. It's great because it covers it from start to finish. So if you guys are new or you're experienced, but you wanna dabble into it because it can seem a little intimidating at first. It was for me when I wasn't used to making purchases on Binance Smart Chain. J Rocco did a fabulous job at making this very easy to follow. So check it out. Speaking of Binance Smart Chain, the Daily Hoge saying, quote, more bridges will be made, more partnerships will be formed. This was from Hoge Marketing. This again was during the AMA. And I bring this up again because I'm really excited. We know that Solana Bridge was being talked about. We do know that Wiser said that they're looking into very likely for the Cardano bridge. I'm really excited about those two. Let me know guys if there are other blockchains that come to mind that you think are very important for Hoge to bridge to because that's really part of the Hoge Everywhere campaign. In regards to NFTs, Boneyard NFT. The Hoge folks have been absolutely wonderful to talk to and they understand the utility and the future implications of what we're doing. Glad to have all of you on board. So we do know that Hoge was in talks with Boneyard NFT. I'm not sure if this was designed by them. I'm just assuming so. And it looks really dope to say the least, like really nicely done. It's simple, but very effective. And Hoge also saying we met with a new NFT project, Boneyard NFT. Their NFTs have utility. If you react to the Hoge welcome message, you'll be entered in for a free mint. Giveaway ends this Thursday, 6 a.m. Eastern. Check out the Hoge NFT. So make sure you guys head over to Twitter. Hoge Finance has their Discord link and you guys can enter to win a free mint. Exciting stuff. And I'm really excited to see where we're gonna head with these collaborations because these NFT collaborations, especially when there's good utility, have the potential of just bringing a lot more mass adoption for Hoge and more eyes on Hoge. I think it's a win-win. So moving on to some philanthropy. Many months ago, if you guys remember, Weekend Mischief doing the streams on Twitch, he held a streaming charity run. Funds were raised from the Hoge community and they went to Patriot Paws. Uh, we raised nearly $11,000 and this paid for two puppies to serve as service animals for disabled vets. And check it out, guys. We know that we named them Hoge and Doge because, of course, Hoge and Doge are brothers. Oh, they're brothers. Oh, all right, all right. Very cute to see this. Uh, we can see in more detail the dogs. So we have Hoge, which is a female gold adorer. I don't know if I'm pronouncing that correctly. Birthday is June 4th, 2021. Very cute. 
and we can also see Doge. We got the male version, same breed, which is incredible. These are very cute dogs, and it's great to see that Hoge uh, putting in those efforts for donations and seeing it come to fruition is just excellent, very heartwarming. Let me know what you guys think about that. Only two cryptocurrencies going into space. Are they in your wallet? We know that Doge has been dabbling into some of this stuff, but Hoge has really been going off with the Hoge Aerospace Institute. We do know that Whitebit and Hoge, they're working together. We're gonna to be putting some donations towards that. And there's a lot that you can find. I recommend heading over to Hoge Nation and checking out all the different articles and PDFs regarding Hoge Aerospace Institute, because this is gonna be great. Not only can it be great from PR, but also utility, creating hype, virality. There's gonna be a lot of case uses for this. So we'll have to wait and see for it to mature a little bit more, but I'm very excited nonetheless. And to wrap up guys, we're gonna finish up with the burn. There's not a whole lot of news right now for Hoge. 29 million Hoge was burned from circulation in the past 24 hours. Now this number coincides with the whale who did a little sell off also, but like I always see with Hoge, the support seems to be very strong and people are always buying up those dips. So it's really great to see that. And I'm really excited about the burn and the volume increasing over time because we do know with Hoge, the OG deflationary meme token, that it's designed for the price to go up. And we just need more volume, we need more adoption. And part of that is expanding our outreach to other blockchains. Another part of that is marketing and whatnot. And I think we're gonna get there. Good things come to those who wait, but not just waiting in a corner of your room, but also working day by day. All those small tasks we do, tweets, likes, subscribing, sharing something, coin market cap, coin gecko, all small stuff that seems minuscule in the grand scheme of things, but it's those micro tasks that you do that all add up to create something massive. Think about an ocean. It's every drop that creates the ocean. It's every grain of sand that creates that desert. And so just something to keep in mind, guys, don't underestimate your potential, your power, and what you can do for Hoj. And like Shane said, Crypto Pulse, for me, often I get impatient. And like he says, if you're impatient, do the work. Do what you can to help promote the project. And that's a wrap for the video, guys. No more Dr. Phil. If you guys enjoyed this video, remember to smash up the like button. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Hit that notification bell. And that way you're alerted of the uploads. And I'll see you guys in the next Hoja video on Friday. Have an excellent day. Take care.